order to uh, gather all the records of this bank depositor in the possession of your Katipunan branch and to be transferred to your office in the central office of this bank, of your bank. You were aware already that an article of impeachment was already filed with this court, with the Senate, by the House of Representatives. Yes, Your Honor, I was aware. Uh, it had been filed probably about a month earlier. Uh, what I was, I mean, I was aware, Your Honor. And uh, uh, if we're not for the information that some uh, members of Congress were uh, asking questions about that account, you would not have ordered the movement of these records to your central office. Uh, possibly no, Your Honor, because I had just... What do you mean by possibly we, no? We did not see the need at that time, so uh, we did not. And you saw the need because of the uh, effort of a member of the House of Representatives to well, gather information about that specific bank account. There was uh, an inquiry about a document. No, just answer my question. Yes, you, Your Honor. If that is yes, so or not. Yes, Your Honor. Very simple. I'm trying to make as clear as possible as I can yes, the question Honor. that I'm asking to you. Yes, Your Honor. Okay. Then, uh, why did you not take the records uh, on that particular time and date in January when you talk to your people in the Katipunan branch at the Red Garlic Restaurant? Well, we had uh, a meeting there and a dinner. It was uh, late. The branch was already closed. Uh, the the and branch secured. was closed. Yes, yes yeah. sir, Your Honor. So you ordered that all the records will be transferred to the central office uh, the following day. Yes, Your Honor. And uh, you sent somebody to retrieve the uh, bank records from the branch? You, uh, did yes. You, did you uh, designate somebody? Yes, Your Honor. Because who, who was that? Uh, this was uh, Mr. Ismael Reyes, our branch banking group head. He was present in that particular meeting. I requested him to personally pick up the documents the next morning. As a matter of practice in your bank, when an event like this where records from a branch of your bank is ordered to be transferred to the central office, do you inventory the uh, records that uh, are contained in the file to be transferred? Yes, Your Honor. And where is the inventory to be made? Uh, at the branch, Your Honor. At the branch. The branch and yeah. the receiving officer from the central office will issue a receipt the detailing and listing in detail the documents to, yes, be trans to be transferred. Yes, Your Honor. Including the file number, if there's a number. Uh, I'm not so certain about those particular details, but uh, yes, there are details of them. Yeah. Now, when this when this uh, record was transferred to your central office, was it delivered to you personally or was it delivered to someone else? It was delivered to me personally, Your Honor. And uh, you check it against the receipt issued by your receiving officer uh, when it got it from the, uh, from the branch? I do not recall ever done, having done so. I was... Uh, no, no, Your Honor. I don't recall doing you, so. You did not. What no. did you do with the, this bunch of uh, records or of file or paper after you received it? After I received it, uh, I was in uh, my room uh, with my executive vice president. I immediately uh, put the documents on my uh, personal uh, uh, cabinet uh, sealed, uh, I mean, uh, with lock and key. I put it there, and then I locked it. And uh, it stayed there until today? It stayed there, uh, Your Honor, until uh, 
the matter of uh, we heard that uh, documents from the bank are going to be uh, subpoenaed. So when I we stayed there up to that time, Your Honor. And uh, no one had any access in, uh, in that uh, uh, depository or uh, vault, if uh, it is a vault. No except, one, Your Honor. Except you. Yes, Your Honor. You had the co complete control of the of the uh, rec the place where the, the record was uh, uh, deposited. Yes, Your Honor. And then after the, the subpoena Duces Tecum was issued, it was transferred back back to the to the branch office. Uh, no, Your Honor. Uh, as soon as uh, we heard, I think it was one afternoon that uh, these uh, documents are going to be subpoenaed. I, uh, I, uh, I asked my executive vice president about it, and he reminded me that about it that it was uh, under control, and we uh, decided to put it under more tighter control, under the control of two uh, two officers, two senior officers. No. While, while the while this uh, this uh, record was moved from the Katipunan branch to your office and you, you receive it there, from that time of your receipt up to the time it stayed in the vault, the entire file was never opened or scrutinized. It was never opened, Your Honor, because it was under my personal control. It was no one, no one in your head office except the one that received it from the Katibonan branch ever had access or has seen.